Hello everyone, this is Yvonne DeSellis from Y Energy. I'm actually standing at the new Leechmere Station. I'm going to just stand up to show you the difference. Leechmere Station used to be on the street. It's now above ground. It's on a raised platform as you can probably see from this view. I'm just waiting because it says that there are going to be trains every 7 to 13 minutes. I am also, while we are waiting, going to show you the new menu. Well, actually, I was kind of hoping to show you the new menu, but I guess I'm not going to be able to do that because I was hoping this would show the new train stations, but this does not. However, the train to Union Square Station is now approaching, so I guess I'm going to keep this recording. I didn't think I was going to need to do that, but it looks like the other train is on its way. It's just one stop from Leechmere to Union Square. Union Square is a long-awaited train station. People have been wanting this for a very long time now, years and years, possibly decades, actually. But I'm going to keep the film going while I do this, and I will try not to talk too, too much. But here we go. I'm getting on the train now. So bear with me for a moment. I hate it when there's steps up to the train not help my knees. I found out that I had knee arthritis on top of everything else. I'm going to sit down somewhere now and I will try to keep you watching where we are going. I'm just going to keep this up to the window. So we're going to leave Leechmere very soon and like I said I'm just going to keep this recording hopefully if my phone is willing to cooperate with me because unfortunately it's an old phone and it is dying and it soon needs to be replaced. So as I said, I'm going to keep this recording going as long as I possibly can, just so you can see where we're going. Although bear in mind, soon it's not going to be the prettiest looking thing. It's not very good as far as view goes, as you can see. Um, let me turn it to the other side, just so you can see a little bit better. So again, we're going from Cambridge to Somerville right now. And sorry for the shaky cam, but that way is Cambridge. And that way is Somerville, and we're heading into Somerville, into Union Square, a very long-awaited train station in Union Square. I probably should have sat on the other side of the train. Sorry about that, folks. I wasn't expecting the view on my side to be so lousy. Not that this view is much, much better, or not. But I think you will agree this may not really be the best view. I'll try it on this side for a little while. <laughs> Sorry for my finger, by the way. Um, this phone is on an armband, and I would let go of the leather piece so you can see it, but if I do that, half of the video will be covered with it, so I don't want to do that. And by the way, if you know anybody who lives in Cambridge or in Somerville who relies on public transportation, please feel free to send them this video. A lot of people don't even know that they opened this station up yet. I don't think they really made a lot of announcements about it. The thing that's really interesting to me is they haven't been charging. Um, they opened the station up a couple weeks ago, and so far it seems to be free going from Leechmere to Union Square and from Union Square to Leechmere. I don't know how long that's gonna last. I don't think that's gonna be a permanent thing. But right now there's no turnstiles, so you can go from one to the other without without paying. Oh, we didn't take them out of service, but that's okay. We're going to the stop, so it's no problem. Sorry again that this view is not better. I think I picked the wrong side of the train to sit up. But I'm going to keep recording because I want you to see where it lets off. There's the lovely graffiti tags. Sorry again that I haven't been talking more. I'm just trying to see if they're going to make any more announcements.
Okay, we are now at Union Square. Bear with me, hold on one sec. Sorry again, my hands got in the way. I had to change the way I was holding my phone. Oh, and my fingers, you can see. That's because I'm trying to hold that leather piece and unfortunately I'm having a really hard time keeping that leather piece under control. But I'm trying very hard to keep it out of view of the camera. So again, please pardon my finger. It's just because I'm trying to hold a piece out of the way of the phone so that you can see better. But as I said, I'm going to take you all the way up to the train station entrance so you can see where this lets off, hopefully, unless my phone decides to shut off on me. So this is Union Square Station. By the way, I want you to see where the new stops are going to be. So this is the new stops. Uh, we are currently at Union Square Station. So Leechmere is new. Well, it's not new, but it's a new station, and then it goes to Union, and it's going to eventually go to East Somerville, Hillman, McCown, Ball, and Medford Tuft, but those are not available yet. They will be soon, but they are not available yet. Someone is calling me, but I'm going to let them go to voicemail, because I'm in the midst of a video. I'm not interrupting it for a call, especially when it's probably a spam call. So anyway, I wanted to show you that new station map. I'm not sure when they're going to open those other stations up. I think it's going to be another six months or so. But I could be wrong. I wasn't expecting them to open Union Square when they did, so maybe they'll be faster than I expect them to be. The really nice thing about this is it makes market basket trips a lot easier than they were before. And there's, it's still a bit of a hike, but it's nowhere near as big of a walk as it was before. You too, you too. We are going to take the elevator up to the street because as I said, my knees, I cannot deal with stairs anymore, unfortunately, because of the bad arthritis I have in my knees, which if you ask me, seems really kind of unfair. Not that life is fair. Having multiple sclerosis and fibromyalgia, I thought that was enough pain for one person, but apparently I was wrong. So I'm taking this elevator up. So you're going to be riding on the elevator with me if you stick with this video, but don't worry, it's only one stop, so this won't be too long. Hopefully. <laughs> Sorry, I just don't want to jinx things. It's only one elevator stop up to the street. We're going to wind up on Prospect Street, and I may even keep this going until I get to Somerville Ave. But right now we're going to ride up to Prospect. So once again, that's the station, and the elevator's closing now, but that's the station, that's the new station, Union Square, and we are going up top, up onto Prospect Street, because once again, I want you to see where this lets off. The biggest question I had when I found out they were making a station here is where are they putting it? It was really hard to figure out where it was going to be. There's going to be a walkway that goes all the way down, I think, to Somerville Ave. If you look off in the distance up to the left, I can't really point because I have something in my other hand, but off in the distance on the left side, there's a Dunkin' Donuts sign. That is on the intersection of Somerville Ave and Prospect Street. So this is where the Union Square station lets off. I am going to stop recording because I'm carrying things with both hands. But once again, if you know anyone who takes the train, please tell them about this. Oh, by the way, this stuff here, you may or may not be able to see this is a walkway that they are working on building it's not really going to let off onto somerville ave but it's going to be a lot closer it's going to let off right here onto prospect street which is maybe like a half a block away from somerville ave once again somerville ave is where that dunkin donuts sign is so this is the union square station brand brand new very happy that it's here because once again it makes going the market basket a little less difficult than it used to be. So once again